Hello everyone. Uh, for this lesson three recap, we're actually going to be starting back where we left off in lesson two, and we're going to be adding some color to our stickman. So we see here that right now it's a gray background, uh, very colorless. So let's work on that. If we look in our code, we see that we have our size back over here. And one thing I'm going to do is change our background from instead of uh, a gray, uh, a dark gray, let's make it a lighter gray. So we can do that by using our background uh, function that we learned about. And one thing that I didn't mention in the lesson is that you can actually just use a single value for this. So if I put in background for 200, that will actually, if I show it here, uh, and make that a little bit wider, let me try 230. Yep, if we now look at the stick man, is that the background's a bit lighter. So when we use that single value, that 230, uh, that's basically like a grayscale value where zero is fully black and 255 is fully white. So when you're using RGB, if you just want a gray value, you can just use a single digit like that. Okay, let's go back to our code. So we now have a brighter background. Let's make it so that our body, let's say he's wearing a nice red shirt. So what we're going to do is because a line is a stroke, uh, it doesn't really have anything to fill with. We're going to be using the stroke command. And a nice bright red shirt, we're going to be using the color code for red, which is 255.00. And because uh, processing works where you have to say uh, your modifier before the line, this will not only change the body, it will also change the arms and the legs. So and, and uh, now we can use some foresight here and say, Let's say he doesn't wa only want uh, red pants too. Let's say he wants blue pants. So what we could do is we can change it again here and say, let's have him wear some nice blue pants. So now we have our red here. We have our red coloring. And now down here, we have our blue coloring. So now when we hit run, uh, if we take a look at our stick man, we see that he has a lot more, uh, one moment, a lot more color to him. We see now he has that red shirt and he has that blue pants. So adding these colors, it's pretty simple to add colors, but it can add a lot of variety uh, to your program and it can make things uh, look much better. So uh, I hope you enjoyed and we'll see you in the next lesson. Bingo!